Okay, I'm about to produce a pressure profiling shot with the Vesuvius. Um, what I've done, I've popped a mirror there, but hopefully you can just see the shower screen and when it begins to sweat out. So I've set the lever up so there is fully closed because on the, uh, sorry, not the minima, the ACS minima, the uh, flow rate's very, very high. So I really don't need the full movement of the lever as I would say on a Bianca. So the close point is about there. I'm going to go a little open from closed. You might or might not be able to see the timer. And uh, I'm going to pull a shot and profile it while you can also watch the shower screen, hopefully, and see the sweating out. I'll move the cup slightly. Hopefully, you get a, a good view. Okay. So what I normally do is start up for a very little flow. Just tweak it open a bit. I let the pump on. And I'm going to have to move this cup over. What it'll do... It'll allow it to fill up to about two bar. There it goes, two bar. Just hold it at around two. And then what I'll do now is climb it right away. Move the paddle all the way. Get a proper flow going. Give it some time. And then bring it down to eight. And seven. And then say five to finish the shot at 34 grams okay it's important once the group has filled if you want to pause it at two bar to allow the puck to soak it is important to turn it right the way around and get a good flow going before you start trimming it down because even a little bit of flow once everything's pressurized and stuff's not moving through the puck will cause the pressure to rise up to nine bar but you won't be getting enough flow for a good shot so you open it up and then you can start profiling it down, as you saw. I normally leave the group, the paddle, sort of in the open position, because um, that's, that's how I leave it. I don't really want to leave it in the closed position. Um, and also it helps me when I'm going to rinse out the group. I've actually been making the grind tighter and tighter. <laughs> my, it's my cat in the background on the pressure profiling shots. So I've tightened up the grind even more. And here I'm going to do another profile shot. So we'll set up for that. A little bit of flow. A bit tricky reaching over the machine. You can just see the shot timer there. So I'll be looking to trickle up to about two bar and then hold it there. So that's uh, about two bar. We'll keep it there. And we'll wait. And we'll just let that go for a little while. Now I'm going to take it up to eight, all the way up, and then bring it down. 8 bar and I'll do the bulk of the shot at 8 bar as the puck permeability changes I'm going to have to do what the computer on a Vesuvius does and I'm trying to watch the four now back to 7 and then stop the shot so it's slightly over 45 seconds and uh, hopefully it'll taste all right. Looks okay. So it shows you can do a, a variety of shots. Let's try it. Yeah, it's different again when you do that. Again, even finer grind, longer pre-infusion. As I say, it's an experimental thing for those who want to play around and just try and extend what they're doing. Um, is it better or worse? Is it different? I don't know. Different's good sometimes. Nice to have a change.